every pains. Every pains is being removed. The source of the pains are being removed. He says, say, I'm healing pains. I'm taking away pains. Every family that is passing through pains, whether they be financial pains, whether they be spiritual pains, whether they be marital pains, whether they be business pains, they are being removed. The pains are removed in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I don't know why I'm going into, why he's taking me into politics. I see like a gang up. I see like a gang up. I see like a gang up. I see like a conspiracy. I see a gang up. I see like a fear. If we allow this to happen, all these things we've been enjoying, all of them we go. And I see like a gang up. And I see a sword coming down from heaven. And I say, God, what is this sword? He said, I will turn or we use the sword to turn them against themselves. He said, they will eat their own flesh and they will drink their own blood. He says, many that have gang up and said, no, if we allow this, this will not continue. This, this we are enjoying will not continue. Why will it profit us if the citizens are, in, are enjoying, are prospering? Quite nothing is working for us. And they were conspiring, saying that I see a sword coming down from heaven. And I saw a very long sword. The height of it is like from the cloud to the ground. I see a sword. He said, look, the sword, I pierce the sword in the midst of the earth. He said, it will follow, it will fight. It will rise up as many that vow that Nigeria will not have rest. He says, sword is coming in their midst. A sword is coming to their home. A sword is coming to their business. He said, the things that have, they have gathered, suddenly those things will diminish. They will disappear. The things where things they have built their resources into, he said, they will collapse. They will collapse. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. He said, I'm turning the table against the wicked in this country. I see something, I see something, I saw it last week when I was praying. I saw like, I saw like a massive crowd entering Nigeria. And I saw desolated lands, vacant lands that were not used in different states of Nigeria. And behold, and it's not black, I saw, I saw white foreigners. I see foreigners entering this country. Suddenly Nigeria, to enter Nigeria became as difficult as when you are entering America. That is what I saw. When I was praying, the Spirit of God was trying to show me last week it was not clear. But right now, it's very clear to me now. Because I saw where I stopped where I saw people entering. I didn't see their color. Behold, they are white. They are not blood. They are, foreign. they are speaking different tongues. These are non-Nigerian tongues. I saw the people that ran out of Nigeria. I saw them rushing back to Nigeria. I see lands. I see lands being developed properties, land, selling of land, became, land properties became over expensive in this country. Father, I thank you. I thank you. And I see buildings springing up forth. I see buildings springing forth. I see buildings. He said, have I not said I told you that three white horns, feminine horns that will spring forth. And these feminine horns will represent prosperity in this nation. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. I see money. Oh, he said, he said speak what I'm showing you. I see money. Oh, be released. I see sudden rewards coming to you. The people you labor for that true you are that forgot to. I saw something strange. I see them returning to tell you apologize. Please forgive us. Please take this. We are coming. Please take this. We are coming. I, I don't know the English to use for it, but that is what I saw. I saw labors, labors that people labored and were not rewarded. He says, see, I've heard the cry of men and I've come down to reward them. As many that have And those labors were not rewarded. I see the God of rewards coming down. 
in the name of Jesus Christ. I see companies calling. I see like I see three, I see three companies. I see three companies that sold so many things. Call pay calling some of their staffs to pay back their money into their account. It has never been done before. He say because my hand has rest upon this country. It is my time. He said, my eyes is fixed on Nigeria. My eyes. He said, my eyes has been fixed in United States of America. He said, now my eyes is fit in, fixed in Nigeria. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. And I see the name Nigeria changed. I see the name change. I see the, the, way, the way they bring states together and call it United States of America. This thing will not exceed two years. I see the name Nigeria change to another name because of so many things that have been rearranged so that to make room for every state, every indigent to come in in unity. Thank you, Father. Thank you. I saw it written boldly like as if it's a bow. As the way you see, see rainbow, as if it's a bow. I see it written, it's the name of Nigeria, change. I saw the end. He said the same way I changed the former name of United States of America. And I called them. He said that is how the name of Nigeria will be changed to. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. I see Ashma, Ashma healed. I've witnessed Ashma here 27 years, 15 years, 10 years healed here. So I know God has that ability. I've seen God heal asthmatic people from my, through my hands here many. 27 years, 15 years, 10 years, 6 years. He said, now he said, I'm healing asthma. He said, anyone that have that asthmatic problem, he said, you are healed. The demons tormenting your breath has been removed. Your lungs are healed. Your breath are restored. In the name of Jesus. He said, I'm healing heart afflictions. I see pie healed. If you are having pie, wherever you are watching me from, just place your hand on your bottom or put your hand there. Anywhere you are, you are healed of that pie. You are healed of that pie, says the Spirit of God. You are healed of that pie in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father. Thank you. Anyone that is having ratchets on the skin, any kind of ratchets, blood diseases, affliction, you are here. Your blood is healed in the name of Jesus. I command the ratchets disappear now in the name of Jesus. By the Spirit of God that is healing, he said, declare the blood healed. I command your blood healed. He said, declare the bones healed. I command your bones healed. He said, declare the organs healed. I command your organs healed. He said, command the brain to be healed. I command your brain to be healed. He said, command the joints to be healed. I command your joints to be healed. In the name of Jesus, your blood is healed. Your veins are healed. Your cells are healed. Your mortal bodies are healed. Your organs are healed. Your brain is healed. Your brain is healed. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus. I've never seen this. Something is happening in River State. I was sharing with somebody. I saw the governor came to my house in a dream. It was a dream. God didn't show me. I saw it in a dream. He was asking me, what did I do to you? That everybody prophesied for my favor is only you that prophesy I will fail. I said, I didn't know. I only said what God showed me. And I sent them to tell you not to go. But still you went. He said, what will I do? That was my dream. But right now, I saw a repentance in the heart of the governor of this state. And the Spirit of God said, I've given him another heart. 
I see him returning back to reconcile so many things. I see him paying back so many things. The things he took by force, I see him giving them back. I don't know how many months he have to rule this state. But the governor of this state, Unye Sonwike, will do what he what he's, uh, he's, he has started doing or about to start do, doing, we amaze so many people. You know me, I'm, I'm, I'm not in any, I don't believe in that. I say what I see. I see a man crying and I see another spirit entered his heart. And I saw his hand. I saw more sand, clay sand on his hand. I said, Lord, why is his hand? He said, because he has put his hand to build the river state. And he has asked God to forgive him. If you give me this privilege to repair, I will repair. And suddenly, suddenly from this July, people will begin to breathe fresh air in river state. I'm telling you, align not by the spirit of God what I saw. This is what I saw right now. Now people start commenting, wow, this is good. Wow, this is good. Wow, not only building fly, people were just talking. The people that stood up against him started celebrating him. But I saw another spirit entered him. And I saw his hands dirty with three kinds of soil in his palm. And God said, I want to use him the remaining quarter to heal this land. And people rushing and start rushing back. He will bring in so many polities that will make people to breathe in fresh and peaceful air. I see him going even forcing landlords to bring down rents. It was to that point. I saw him on the streets. The streets on the Mimedis and now you must drop the rent. You must be. I saw him entering market. This market is giving for social price. Madam, I saw like on television, a woman like as if I'm watching a television. I see like you say, oh, God, no be so. I say now 50,000, but today pay 300. Say, from today, I drop it to 15,000. I see him drop. If any person forces you to pay otherwise, report. I saw so many people he put on the street. I see him withdraw them. I don't know what is happening, but that is what the Spirit of God showed me. And the fear that made so many to run out of River State. So many that have started selling their properties, about to sell, we stop. Father, thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. I didn't say he, I didn't say we is bad. But I said what the Spirit of God have showed me. That is what I saw. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. I hear anyone watching me, put your right hand on your head. Put your right hand on, the, on your head. Anyone watching on top of your head, not on your forehead. Wherever you are, put your hand. You say, receive my peace. Receive my wealth. Receive my prosperity. He says, say it again. Receive my peace. Receive my wealth. Receive my pro prosperity. He says, say it again. Receive my peace. Receive my wealth. Receive my kind of prosperity. Everybody shout, I receive. Thank you, Father. He said, my peace I give unto you. The peace that silence, that quench every storm. He said, my word I give unto you. He said, my word is not your word. The wisdom of my word is upon you. Is I give you my prosperity. And I say to you, prosper in all things. In the name of Jesus. Thank you.
you, Father. And whenever you are watching, if you have any sore on your body, you are healed of the sore. If you have any growth in your body, the growth disappears. In the name of Jesus. The power of sicknesses and diseases is broken in your life. Anyone under the sound of my voice that is in any kind of demonic bondage, you are loose from that bondage. In Jesus' name. I hear this word. He said, tell everybody, both here, those watching you to smile and laugh. He said, this one is me that commanded. It's my laughter I give to them. When I visited Abraham, I made him and his wife to laugh. He said, all the days of July, you will encounter my divine visitation. Each of the visitation will leave you with laughter. He said, you will laugh. They that hear of my goodness in your life will laugh with you. He said, from this day, I have made you to laugh. You will no more sign. The things that make you sign, the things that make you toil, he said, I've removed them from your life. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name. Thank you, Father. These are what I saw. God bless this world. Let's be seated in his presence. I thank God I did not withhold from saying